All right, so one thing that you might run into is John decides to drive in very, very heavily to try and put me back on my back, okay? And, you know, there's a certain amount of pressure he can apply that I just won't be able to sit up through, okay? But I want to make him, like, I want to be actively making him, like, feel some pressure so he has to drive hard, okay? Because the harder he drives back into me, drive, drive me back more. Okay, so he's starting to lift his right leg up, okay? John's driving, trying to drive me flat. Yeah, like this, right. So I'm gonna change, I'm gonna make that work against him, okay? Because he doesn't have great base and he usually has to lift his right leg up to actually have some drive, okay? If he keeps his knees on the ground, I don't think he can out beat my, just my hip escapes here, all right? So at this point, I'm gonna reach over and cup his lat to be able to pull him and I'm gonna hook sweep and I'm gonna go with the momentum and actually fall back and lift him, okay? So. John stands up, and I lift him up with my hook. It's okay if your hook, it's like a reverse hook sweep, and you can slide it all the way down to the ankle. This is even better, okay? So you'll end up in this scrambly position here. Now, ideally, I come on top from here, and I take top position. A lot of the time, your opponent will post to not go over, but that will, he's lost my hips, I can now frame, and get back to recovering. So we sit up into our opponent, we're pressuring, we're trying to get up, okay? change, he posts, and I recover, or if he doesn't post, if he's trying to hang on, which you know, often they want the hips, right, then you're going to take him over and try to get on top. course is on smash pass retention. So the smash pass is one of the most effective ways to pass the guard and in this course we want to show how to stop it. We have early retention where we prevent our legs getting smashed in the first place. We can use the high pummel to recover, potentially use the hip escape or invert to get out of the smash pass attempt. We'll have a mid-stage retention where we try to sit up on our opponent and prevent them from putting us flat. From here we can look to recover our legs and use reverse hook sweeps to try to off balance our opponent. Then we have late stage defense, which is obviously getting much harder, where our opponents manage to flatten us out and has our legs smashed. And from here, we try to pummel hooks to recover our guard. So let's get started with the course, smash pass retention. 